Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Evan and I'm a person like Smonga and today we have an unboxing. This is kind of random, but I just realized that this is my first time really showing my face in a video. I'm pretty sure in like one of my previous videos you can like catch it for a second. But this is my first time like actually showing my face, so hi. Now, I wasn't really trying to like make a sort of character or like a uh, profile, you know, to where I don't even show my face at all, kind of like the manga sloth, which by the way is content good. Check them out. Um, but I just kind of recorded my videos in the way that I thought was like the most, you know, convenient to record. And today, just recording with my face in it, uh, felt the most convenient. So, yeah. Let's just get straight into the unboxing, so. Yep. Let's just cut this thing open if I can. There we go. Alright. We pull out. My first really... This is my first box set, really. The Bakuman box set, which is volumes 1 to 20 of this series. Uh... You know, I got this as basically, I guess, kind of a reward for uh, finishing the school year with all A's. I know, I'm so smart. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, I guess technically now I could, I'm smart enough to tutor people, and I hope I'm able to tutor five um, quintuplets specifically. You know, that'd be pretty nice. But uh, my older sister, she has a Attack on Titan box set, which is volumes 1 to 4. But this is uh, my first box set, so... That's pretty cool, and with this, I'll have over a hundred volumes, which is pretty crazy. But I, uh, I don't really know that much about the series. I just know it's about manga making. My English teacher, she actually had a couple of the volumes in her room, and I read one of them, and I really liked it. So, uh, yeah, this is really it. But yeah, I'm really excited for this. Yo, ASMR. Alright, that's cool. Um, now, let's open the actual thing. All 20 volumes of this series. Is that all 20? That's pretty cool. Uh, so yeah, I got this off Amazon. It was actually for like 111 bucks, which is actually a really good deal. You know, actually, this is a pretty cool box set. Here, I'll, I'll show you guys real quick. Like, like you could see, uh... Got some cool stuff here. Yeah, they're all like freaking out about how to box it. So yeah, and we've got all 20 volumes. Um, pretty sure it comes with like something, I don't know. It comes with a poster. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it came with this like uh, nice, shoot, came with this like nice double-sided poster, which I guess I could put on my wall after I read the series. And it looks like there's something else here. I don't know what this is, but it's like a little book thing. What is this? Uh, it just looks like a, like a manga with a ton of writing. I don't know what this is, but... Alright, that's pretty cool. I don't really know what this is, but it'll probably make sense once I actually read the series, so, yeah. I do know that, um, one thing about the series is that, uh, it's by the same authors of Death Note, so, you know, I'm expecting it to be really good. And just based off this box set, the art looks pretty... Pretty nice, so. I, I think I'll kind of record this uh, video kind of like uh, Captain Ryan's. Uh, if, you, if you haven't seen his channel either, he's really good. He has some of the best content on YouTube, in my opinion. Where he, he's done series where he like, he takes a box set, he reads it all, and kind of documents his thoughts about it as it goes along. And then just makes this one big, chunky video. So it's like kind of like his review on it, so. I think I'll do that so I could kind of like you can you know give you guys my idea on the how I think about Bakuman and if it's worth it to pick up and yeah I think we'll make this video part reorganization because we have a lot of stuff to add on to this shelf so yeah enjoy it.
I guess this is what we're working with for now. I'm probably gonna have to change this a bit because I'm not really loving how it's looking, so. Uh, I changed it a bit and I didn't think it'd come to this anytime soon, but I actually think I might have to get a new shelf soon. Let's get reading. I've been reading for about 30 minutes and I'm not even halfway done yet. Like, look how much writing there is in this manga. Like, all right, I finally finished volume one. All right, this is just a little update. So I, I just finished volume six, so I started reading volume seven. And so far, my opinion on the series is that it's really good. Like, it's really good. Um, So far, it's definitely worth the money that, like, the box had cost. It's, like, it's really good. But the only thing about it is, I already mentioned this earlier, but there's just so much writing in this series. So one volume takes me, like, an hour, because I'm a slow reader, so it takes me, like, an hour or more just to read a single volume. But it's still really good. Uh, like, my older sister, she's reading it too. She said that it's really predictable to her, but uh, some of the things in the series I'm not expecting at all. So, so far, it's really good. Uh, my favorite character is Hattori. This video, I was planning to get it out like a week after I made my past video where I was shopping with friends. But I think this video is going to be kind of late. So, yeah. All right, let's go and read volume number eight. Oh no. That is not good. Alright, that took forever, but I finally finished this volume. It I've been reading for an wait, how long has it been? I've been reading for an hour and 40 minutes. Oh my, that one volume took an hour and 40 minutes to read. Wait, is that right? 20 mi Yeah, this this volume took about an hour and 40 minutes to read. That is... Jeez. I guess I'm... I'm a, Either I'm just a freaking slow reader, or these volumes are just longer than I thought they were. Okay, well yeah, finish volume 8. I'm gonna go and keep reading later, but I'm gonna take a little break for now. Alright, kind of just a little update. I just finished volume 15, getting started with volume 16. I I just don't, like, it's such a good series. I think it actually might be my new favorite manga series. It just keeps getting better and better. Like, I don't think at any point in this series, it's actually been, like, you know, bad. That's, that's how good the series is. There's no action in it. I already said this, like, many times before. There's a lot of writing, but this style of a manga, it's a lot different from what you'd, like, usually see in a shonen manga which is why I think I actually like this more, you know? Like, most is just action, but this one, like, it's barely any action, so that's why it's way more different and interesting. I'll probably be back here when I've actually finished the series. So yeah, I'm currently in Florida, actually. I only brought up to volume 18, and it's only the second day here, and I'm already gonna start 16, so, you know, I'm probably gonna be done pretty soon, but you know, Bakuman's really good. All right, let's get started with volume 16. Bruh, nothing like reading some manga while well, it's raining like heck outside. This video is brought to you by Aquafina. I didn't bring enough because like for the last few days I had nothing to do. I mean nothing to like read. But I'm still going to grab volume 19 to read. 
All right, here we go. Last volume of Bakuman. Um, I've been reading this for a while now, so I yeah. Let's just get reading. I guess I'll do another time lapse again, but yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm done with the series, and then I'll give you guys my opinion on it. <laughs> oh my God, you're freaking kidding me! Chapter 172, wow. Oh my gosh. Ah. Alright, we got the final chapter. This is kind of sad now. This series is so good, man. No. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna say this is my new favorite series now, okay? Uh I'll be back to you guys when I'm gonna give you guys my review on the series. Man. Jeez, that was a roller coaster ride. All right, time to give you guys my spoiler-free review on Bakuman. Um, I'll give you guys a little synopsis at the end of this review. Um, don't worry, it's not gonna be any spoilers or anything because, you know, it's just gonna be a basic synopsis. If you wanna go into this series blind, um, feel free to do so, but it's not gonna be any crazy spoilers, you know? Kinda like how in Attack on Titan, everybody knows that like in episode one or in volume one, that the wall comes down and then they want to fight the Titans, you know, because the Titans eat humans. Like, it's slightly spoilers, but everybody knows it, so. Yeah, um, anyway, Bakuman, really good series, uh, it's a manga series about making manga, so it's something that you don't see every day, it's not a fighting show in like Demon Slayer or anything like that, um, but it's by the artist and writer of Death Note, so the art and story is really good, um, it's a perfect match for each other to be honest, honestly the 20 volumes that I read, it felt more like, you know, I felt like I read like 30 volumes or something like that, because I've said this before, but each volume is like really long, so I felt like I read like 30 volumes of content. Um, yeah, uh, this the series, there's no action in it, so if you're like into like fighting shonen and like, um, and if you don't like it when it's just like you know no fighting at all, then um, I wouldn't recommend this to you. It's still like intense, but there's no like actual action. You know, the most action you you'll get is like, say somebody jumps off a table or something like that. That's an example. That's like the least. That's like the most, sorry, amount of action you'll get. But um, yeah, the box set itself comes with 20 volumes. There's The volumes aren't in here right now, this is just the box. And this mini manga by one of the manga artists in the series, one of the characters in the series. And it comes with a poster, which I'll show you guys later. Um, but yeah, uh, yeah, that's really all I had to say about just Bakuman in general. Uh, the series, it it's like really, it's really exciting. It's more exciting than you would think it would be. Like, um, whenever they have like success or whenever they have failure, like your emotions, like, like, like you can't, you can't help but smile at some parts and you can't help but feel kind of sad at some parts. So yeah, Bakuman is really good. All right, there's the poster right there. Um, I can't really show you the other side, but you could kind of see that at the start of the video, but I don't really have, I didn't really have time to record this the other day. So I kind of record this right now. Basically, the synopsis of this series, this guy right here, he's the main character, his name is Moritaka Mashiro. And as you could tell, um, basically from his cover, is that he really likes to draw. And basically, um, when he was a young kid, he really wanted to become a manga artist because his uncle was one of the most famous manga artists in Shonen Jump around the 90s. So he really wanted to be like his uncle and become a professional manga artist. But as he got older, that like um, dream of his um, slowly vanished. I won't tell you guys why, because that's slight spoilers. Um, but basically, when he gets into middle school, he's um, still good at drawing, you know. He still has that talent, um, but he's pretty average at like school and, you know, academics and stuff like that. You know, you're a normal shonen prota protagonist. All right. This guy right here, his name is Akito Tagagi. He's basically the opposite of a um, mashiro basically 
he's like really pop he's not really popular but he's like popular he um is really smart and um he's basically at the top of the class and he also really likes manga so takagi he realizes mashiro has a skill and a talent for drawing and you know making that sort of art style for manga so um takagi um one day he decided to ask mashiro to team up and create a manga where mashiro would draw the would do the art and takagi would create the story and at first um, Ma mashiro is against it until um this character is introduced her name is miho azuki um she's basically you know like the cute girl that all the guys have a crush on at school um and one of those guys that has a crush on her is um mashiro and basically takagi knows this as a fact so in a act of desperation to convince mashiro to team up with him he brings um mashiro to um azuki's house and then he tells azuki that they're gonna make a manga together and azuki is all for it because basically um at this moment we learn that azuki really wants to become a voice actress and like that's her dream so she said um that um they should sometimes make a manga that could be turned into an anime and then she could play the main female protagonist role in that and then uh out of nowhere mashiro becomes really embarrassed and for some reason asks um azuki if you if she will marry him i don't know why but yeah because he thought that she was cute or something i don't know but um she was very embarrassed about it at the start but then we find out actually that she liked mashiro back lucky him so uh basically she says that they will only be able to like date each other and like you know actually see each other after they carry after um Takagi and Mashiro create a manga series that is turned into an anime and she plays the main female protagonist in that series so basically it turns into a romance series you know um and then it's uh basically them trying to create a manga and trying to strive for this goal and yeah it's a actually a lot more than you would think that goes into this like manga making business because they have to like create storyboards and send it into like editors and then like there's a uh, different people that they compete with to try and get better rankings for manga so yeah all that crazy stuff in it it's a really good series i would recommend it for anybody uh i don't really know how to end this video but i guess i'll just end it here but uh i'm recording this a few days after i finished bakuman and it's actually kind of sad because you know sometimes i'm kind of just like you know what i'll read some manga right now and i'm like all right well, i'll read the next volume in bakuman but i'm like no it's ended because it's my first time really finishing a manga series so yeah but bakuman's really good um if you're into like the sort of like if you want to try and take a break from like normal modern battle shonen then go ahead and take a little break and read some bakuwan so yeah definitely recommend the box set for anybody so yeah thank you guys for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next one